It has only been one year since Cristiano Ronaldo sealed his 112 million euros, 99.2 million pounds, move to Juventus from Real Madrid but the Portuguese star has hinted he could pack it all in at the end of the season. The 34-year-old revealed his thoughts about retirement when speaking to Portuguese channel TV1, although he did admit he could continue playing past 40. Last season Ronaldo scored 28 goals in 43 games in all competitions as Juve secured another Serie A title, however, their Champions League campaign was brought to an abrupt halt by Ajax. I don't think about that, Ronaldo told TV1 when speaking about retirement. Maybe I can leave my career next year, but I can also play up to 40 or 41. I don't know. What I always say is to enjoy the moment. The gift is excellent and I have to continue to enjoy it. The five-time Ballon d'Or winner also questioned whether players who go for huge sums in today's transfer market are actually worth the amount paid for them. He held the world record fee back in 2009 when he left Manchester United to join Real for £80 million, which was a substantial profit for the Red Devils, as they signed him for just over £12 million as an 18-year-old from Sporting Lisbon. However, with the exception of his compatriot João Felix, Ronaldo thinks players can now easily go for €100 million Euros without having to back it up with performances on the pitch. It's difficult to make calculations in modern football, Ronaldo added. Clubs gamble a lot on potential and the football industry is different. Leaving the case of João Felix to the side, any player can go for 100 million euros, even without showing anything. There is more money in football. A centre-back and a goalkeeper can go for 70 million euros or 80 million euros. I don't agree with it, but it's the world that we live in and you have to respect it. Serie A has a later start to their season than most European leagues and Juventus begin their campaign to win a ninth straight title away to Parma on Saturday. Parma just avoided relegation by three points last season so are not expected to put up much of a contest for new Juve boss Maurizio Sarri. However, the week after will see Sarri take on his former club Napoli, who finished second in the league last season, before they travel south to take on Fiorentina. Let's block ads.